guy who first called this the Gold Coast of Miami knew what he was talking about. He picked the right word. Most people who come here live it up. Just a few miles from Miami Beach are the vast swamplands known as the Florida Everglades. Most things that land here die. I came on a job that involved to both places. My name is Jagger, Don Jagger. Deputy Chief of Operations, United States Border Patrol. United States Border Patrol. Filmed on location in cooperation with the Immigration and Naturalization Service, United States Department of Justice. And starring Richard Webb. The United States Border Patrol is the only federal law enforcement body whose operations include the air, the sea, and the land along the four borders of our country, whose men are the best trained in the world and whose primary mission is to secure the borders against all persons and things illegal, and among whose members is the fastest run alive. The Swank Hotels in Florida put on some unique entertainment for their guests. One of the most popular is alligator wrestling, performed by the Seminole Indians. I dropped into the Fountain Blue Hotel one day to talk to one of the Indians I'd known some time ago, hoping I might get a lead on a gun smuggling racket that was going on in the Everglades. Hello, Johnny. How are you? Hello, Mr. Jagger. What's the matter? You got troubles? Bad knee. How come you're back in Florida? I'm on a case, Johnny. I work out of Washington now, all over the country, sometimes abroad. Troubleshooter? Yes, kind of. Hey, Johnny, you hear anything unusual out of the Glades these days? No. But funny you turn up right now. How so? I go back to village this weekend. First time in months. I'm a new gator. This one's not good anymore. Lazy. Say, hey, Johnny, do me a favor, will you? Keep your eyes and ears open for me. Sure, Mr. Jagger. What about the chief? You think he might know something? Chief tells nothing. <laughs> what do you want, Mr. Jagger? Oh, same as always. Anything out of the ordinary in the glades and around the Mango Islands. You do not tell Johnny about case. Any more than you tell people where you get your gators. Okay. Where do you stay? I'm here in the hotel. You best check with patrol headquarters first. They'll always know where I am. Okay. Johnny, uh, how about taking me gator hunting one of these days? No. Same place, same secret. Same Johnny Wildcat. See you around. smuggling deal in years, Hank. How'd you get on to it? A tip from another government agency. Looks like illegal aliens. Routine reports from dealers. All the purchases purported to be for the legitimate government. Seemed logical, all of it freighted to various cities in Florida, but the government had never heard of the purchases or the purchaser. M41. Only name deal. We're back in the air. There's one other thing, though. What's that? Monitoring the short wave, we've picked up signals in Spanish on unassigned frequencies. Where from? That's the killer. Could be on a boat, could be a transmitter in the glades. But they're never on long enough for anybody to get a fix. KAD 264, M41, that is... Well, it hasn't turned up on this end, Don. M41... 117 airports, 10,000 square miles of swamp, 10,000 islands. Never could keep our eye on all of them. Better we go back. No. We see what happens. Alligator. Mario! A dónde estás? Aquí, Agosto. What were you shooting? An alligator. One shot right behind the eye. You should not have done that, Julio. But I want to test the weapon. Then at least you should pick up the bullet. Por qué? I do not see why. Julio, this is not a hunting expedition. This is the life and liberty of our people, our country. Steel jacket. White hunter. Hunter, do not use steel jacket to hunt animals. What do you do with that? Give it to Don Jagger. We sell skin. How many times have you been told? The least little thing may betray us. 
So small a thing as one bullet. Where is this alligator? Uh, yeah, there. It was right here. What is it? Tell me what you see, you fool. Indians. Nothing but Indians. You fool. They've got the alligator. Come before you get these bright ideas and shoot the Indians. It was all I could do, Senor Vargas, to convince him that a bullet in an alligator is enough, much less a bullet in a man. A bullet in a man, there should be. Lo siento, senor. I meant nothing. Students. Hombres. Es mi culpa por tratar con niños. Students. Ignorance. I'll meet the pilot with the last shipment. And I will see this man who rented out the airport. See if he knows this Indian. And then? Agosto, you come with me. Si. Sí. Julio, pack the box. Muy bien. Start loading the plane. Has everything been arranged? All set. Excellent. Partners file a flight plan. Takes off in the other plane legitimately. Cruises around the Gulf, listens in on a coastal wavelength. And if anybody challenges us, he answers with a legitimate clearance. Excellent. We're going to do much business together. You can go, then come back here and wait for us. Us? Where are we going? Frankly, I don't know yet. But if you want the rest of your money, you better come along. seen any alligators. Engine just brought one in. You better not shoot none. Why not? But the one who did they ask him for the jailhouse. Engine found a bullet in that gator's head and he's taken it into town. Yep. Folks don't take kindly to poaching alligators. Where can I find him? Grassland alligators down to Fontainebleau, Miami Beach. Fine, fine. Found this in an alligator? Steel jacket. They only use these to hunt human beings. Fresh kill. Where was the gator? On hammock. Could you pinpoint it on the map for me, Johnny? No. Why not? I do not tell everybody. Only Mr. Jagger. KD264, off and clear. Mr. Jagger understands special place. You give him bullets and say Johnny will be at hotel. Yes. Border Patrol can prove bullet did not come from my gun. Bullet? What bullet? From alligator head. Show me. Patrol got it. You can check. I don't believe you. Then you will wait for Border Patrol men to come here. Then I will tell whole story. We'll do better than that. We'll go to the Border Patrol, see whether or not you've been poaching alligators. I got a show coming up. It won't take long. Come on. Hey, Johnny, don't get lost. You got a show to do. I'll be back. Police want to talk to me about alligators. Okay. The 
Yeah. Okay, where to? Headquarters. What police? This is all you have to know. When I got back to headquarters, I found out Johnny had been there. I immediately headed for the hotel, knowing a steel-jacketed bullet was a real lead. I'm looking for him myself. He was here just a minute ago. I was just talking to him. He said something about the police and an alligator. Was he with anybody? Yeah, the police. Plain clothes. What did he look like? Well, I'd say dark. Latin American. Mustache. Kind of hard like those Cuban guys and the local police. Uh, thanks, kid. this out. The answer, negative. Johnny was in trouble. The only one who could help us was the chief. I radioed for another car to meet us at the village of the Billy tribe. Game warden. How are you? I understand somebody's been shooting some alligators around here. That isn't all that's going on. You mind if I join you? No, come on. to take us to the place where you and Johnny found that gator. It is sacred place. My people's sleeping place. Burial place. I was afraid of something like this. No, I cannot tell you. We're not asking for ourselves. We're asking for Johnny. He's missing. Missing? How you know Johnny at that sacred place? I don't. But some strange men picked Johnny up. I have a hunch they may be in that area. Now, if we get there in time, and Johnny's not with them... You can ask those men yourself what they've done with him. Dead or alive. Mr. Jagger. Yes, Chief. If Johnny die, nothing make difference no more. Nothing. I take you. Howard. Henry. Everything goes. Well, what about him? Him too, but not all the way. Hey, I never figured to get mixed up in murder. Senor Vargas, we are patriots, not criminals. Should have told that to Julio before he started shooting alligators. I'll tell you one thing, that plane's going to be pretty heavy on takeoff. Well, there's only one solution. No, Senor Vargas, we cannot kill him. Augusto is right, Senor. Listen. You hear us are wasting time. Come on, make up your mind. Men in uniform, 
from Wicked Indians. It must be the Boiler Patrol. God came from that direction. Uh-huh. There's a shack over there. You see anybody around when you picked up the gator? No, stop. Ask questions. Hank, let's check that place out. Right. Somebody better do something fast. Go ahead, Senor Vaca. It is the arms that are important to our people. We will take care of things here. Leave anything without trouble. Are you not
coming up to us. I'm sorry about the jaw. It could have been worse. What will happen now, senor? Well, you're facing a charge under the Neutrality Act. Possibly a conspiracy charge, along with Vargas and the pilot. That's the business of the U.S. attorney. After that, you'll have an immigration hearing. All I can advise is a cooperative attitude. I'll see they find out what you did for Johnny. I cannot betray Vargas. Our movement needs the guns. Oh, nonsense. You call yourself a patriot. And my comrade, Julio, a martyr. And what do you call Vargas? A businessman buying for the government you are fighting, at the same time selling you the arms to fight them with. A man with a record for doing the same thing up and down the Americas for more years than you've lived. All right, I take your word for it. You're a patriot, but you take mine. Vargas is a profiteer. Think it over. This is a sample of the contraband smuggled out of this country by Vargas and his kind. Vargas, the pilot, and Augusto were convicted on a charge of conspiracy to violate the Neutrality Act. Conviction on such a charge carries a penalty of not more than five years, a $10,000 fine, or both. After that, an immigration hearing was held before a special inquiry officer of the Immigration and Naturalization Service. Augusto, who was granted probation by the court, was permitted to remain in the United States until such time as conditions in his own country are stabilized. Vargas was ordered deported and will be returned to his own country after serving his sentence.